Hey guys, Emily from Create 86 here. Tonight I'm doing my September Fobonichi flip through. Um, I wanted to start in the front just so you could see that um, I do still have my little charm that's holding together a few of my pages where I might index. You can see that we already did the August part, so there are a few pages that I left for indexing, and there's my some journaling cards up front. So this is August, and then here is September. As you can see in Southern California, Central California, the weather is still pretty ridiculously hot. It's been, we've had over, I think, 39 days of 100 degrees or more. Um, so here is my weather. It's nothing crazy. The one on the 8th, we were expecting rain. It didn't happen. Um, so I've had, I marked off my mom's birthday and my girlfriend's birthday and Labor Day. So there's my um, month at a glance. Um, here are, here's the first. I updated social media stats. I went on a Michaels haul. These are the washi tapes that I got. I think they're super cute. I printed a few of these, um, I don't know what you could, journaling things, just decorations. Um, we always do our grocery shopping on the 1st. We paid off my engagement ring. We ordered, I ordered a May book. Um, and I'm keeping track of the time that I wake up so you'll always see a little clock. Um, we watched Keeping Up with the Kardashians season finale. And then on the 2nd, I thought this was really cute. I printed it out. I can smell autumn dancing in the breeze, the sweet chill of pumpkin, and crisp sunburnt leaves. Now, I'm from Pennsylvania, so that means a lot. <laughs> California, it's still 100 degrees. It's not so cool yet. And I made a note that I got it from Pinterest. Um, I sent out a fedora on this day, and I had a staff meeting. On the 3rd, I talked with people at work. Um... I have my wake up time, um, printed out my YouTube stats, and updated videos on YouTube. Then I have a little to do list that I printed out along with those, um, these cute little printables. I set up curriculum for fall, had, um, for my church, because I do the curriculum for them, had meetings for decals. And now I'm on a special team for decorating. Um, I worked on making bookmarks. And then I put a quote that I had in my planner. It says, be sure to put your feet in the right place. Then stand firm by Abraham Lincoln. And I really liked it, so I decided to keep it. Um, then I put the decorations for each age group that we're doing. And then my wake-up time. Um, we were watching at this point uh, American Horror Story on the 5th. Um, today was National Cheese Pizza Day. We got Pizza Hut stuffed crust cheese pizza. I haven't had Pizza Hut in a long time. It was very greasy. and That's one of the main reasons I don't eat Pizza Hut. But there's a little picture of pizza, which I don't really do much art. But then I had these really cool um, stickers. So I just decided to fill in some space with stickers and my wake-up time. On the 6th, I started Season 2 of House of Cards. It keeps getting more amazing. Um, these are some of my favorite TV shows right now. American Horror Story Asylum we are watching still. I hope the new season starts around Halloween. Netflix is so much better than Hulu. And another one of those cute printables. Um, I posted my summer bucket list in here and had everything checked off that we did. Um, on the 8th, I can't wait for fall temperatures. Um, Mondays act as planning days for me for the upcoming week. Um, so I have my wake up and then I have a project list. Um, snap. My staff meeting went really well. Ton of new ideas. Here's my fall bucket list, which I also have in my file of facts. My wake up time and just a cute little sticker. The 10th, I created new calendar printouts for my file of facts, but I really ended up putting them in my Fedori. Uh, I talked to my dad on the phone, created a new size Fedori, which fits my new planner pages, which is the 9x5.5, which is the extra large Fedori, which is for sale. 
on Instagram. There have been 39 days so far this summer, 100 degrees or higher, which is really crazy. Um, creating a new website for Create86, my wake up time, and I got snail mail. On the 11th uh, was my cousin's birthday. I worked on the website, I had Bible study, it was our day of prayer. Um, I ordered decals for one of the classrooms and created inventory lists for Create 86. Sorry, my dog is going a little bit nuts. On the 12th, I did a YouTube video, or I posted a YouTube video. Um, I had buffalo chicken salad at Chili's. I hand drew that. I thought it was pretty awesome, because <laughs> I'm not an artist. Um, American Horror Story Season 2. Uh, Dollar Tree Haul. I got lamination sheets. And this was really cool. I got this in a um, from a pen pal. And it's just a, um, like a cutout. On the 13th, I started my fall sale for Create U86 for Fedoris and a bunch of other things that are available on Instagram. Just check out our pictures. It was 105 degrees, which is pretty crazy. Um, I did some babysitting that day with my fiance. We had little Caesars pepperoni pizza for lunch. And that's when we woke up. Um, who turned on the heat? <laughs> we thought it was pretty funny. For people that are living in California or anywhere really hot, um, my fiance saw that on Facebook, so I wrote it down. Once upon a time, we're watching just a little washi pit tape decoration. Watched it quite a bit of YouTube today. Um, we went to a place called Checkers for lunch, which is just fast food, but they have really good sandwiches. Um, looking for new blog content and new collabs for the new website and my wake up time. The 15th, we do we take part in a thing called MOPS, uh, Mothers of Preschoolers at our church. Um, it's from 9 to 11.30, and I work in the infant room. Um, I'm using Monday as planning days for the rest of the week, and then I just have a quote and a cute sticker. Um, the 16th is actually a special day. That would be why there's hearts. So very lucky. Um, Project Life card, and I'm officially engaged on the 16th, so... There's my ring. Um, so I was really excited about that. That was my wake up time. We had a staff meeting. I recycled cans because in California you can actually go get money for recycled cans. Um, and people came to do stuff at the house. On the 17th, I created a brain dump at work to put in my Fedori. Um, my wake up time, I got. We're doing a thing called Trunk or Treat with our church, and I'm in charge of basically setting everything up for it. I got a company to donate snacks for it. Uh, we watched WWE. We worked on, I worked on the website, watched Prison Break, um, season one. We're finally on the last season, in the last ten episodes, I believe. One of the longest shows I've ever seen. Um, and I did a YouTube video. Oops, sorry. Uh, the 18th, I should pick a trunk or, tr trunk or treat theme for the car. Worked 9 to 3, had Bible study, my wake-up time, stopped at the bank, um, stopped at Winco to do grocery shopping or just to get some soda because it was on sale. Did a YouTube update, and we're watching Once Upon a Time Season 2. Um, this is my quote from the day that I showed uh, what my favorite quote was. Um, and then... We are, we were still watching Prison Break Season 2. I did a YouTube video, obviously, and my wake-up time. On the 20th, I did some organization within my business, Fedori. Um, we watched Once Upon a Time. Uh, Regina really is evil, and that's actually Romney said, Romney said that to me on Instagram, which I kind of totally agree with. Um, I set up Evernote on my phone and on my iPad. And I'm doing research for new videos and new setups in my file effects. On the 21st, I created our photo challenge picture for October, which we're super excited about. And we hope everybody enjoys it. Um, I created a Women Who Wow account, and we've been watching Prison Break and Once Upon a Time. Um, updated my file effects pictures on Instagram and updated the Create 86 sale pictures as well. 
and we watched WWE pay-per-view. On the 22nd, um, my wake up, watched WWE Network today, changed the sale pictures on Instagram, Prison Break, Once Upon a Time, um, and I did a lot planning-wise, and I just used this for a cute quote, remember no one can make you feel inferior without your consent, Eleanor Roosevelt. This is where I wanted to show you how I actually keep track of what's in here. Um, I said in one of my videos that I do this once every couple of days, so I wanted to show you how I'm actually doing it. I'm literally using the smallest sticky notes I could find. Um, so here, let me see if I can get it. So I'll write down like my wake up, that I had a staff meeting, stuff about Instagram, what shows I'm watching, and any other little tiny information that I feel like I need. I can stick it right there. I do sometimes pre-decorate. Um, here was another one. As you can see, I just cross them off after I write them. So I left that one blank. I will go back and finish it. On the 24th, I worked 9 to 3, checked emails, returned trunk or, for trunk or treat, had Chinese for lunch, worked on the website, and then put a little quote. And I did a YouTube video and have my wake-up time. I worked 9 to 3 on the 25th, website published, woke up, what should we do for trunk or treat? I got, this is a, um, a chalk pen, um, this is just an index card. I created a blog post, visited Zynga.com. I really like the old farm bill that I used to play. I had checkers for lunch, watched Prison Bake Break, and Once Upon a Time. Friday, I got these at the dollar store. They, find, they restocked these Eiffel Tower stickers, which I grabbed a pack of them, of course, because I didn't get them the first time around. I uh, made macaroni salad for dinner, posted a YouTube video, Watched Once Upon a Time and Prison Break Marathon, basically, all day. Dollar Tree Hall, and it's just saying the Eiffel Tower stickers. And this week was a very productive week. 27th, I have my chicken salad sandwich or chicken salad recipe right here. Um, watched a bunch of WWE. Can't wait for the new season of Sleepy Hollow to start. Prison Break Once Upon a Time, posted a YouTube video, and watched some as well. The 28th, I it was my mom's birthday, so I sent her an, um, an email. Um, we watched Once Upon a Time, I rem and then I have a little bit about like what I remember from before when I used to watch it. I took my Filofax photo update today and watched Prison Break and a little bit more. Um, and there was a new Total Divas on, which we watch as well. The 29th. Um, there's a lot of writing on this one. Nothing super exciting. Um, we woke up because we thought we had mops, but we didn't because it's only the first and third Mondays. Watched Prison Break most of the day. And I wrote down kind of my predictions. I wrote down how Once Upon a Time, um, it's interesting because they've changed the stories around from when we were little. Um, how Peter Pan and the Lost Boys are bad, Ariel's good and bad, Rumpelstiltskin's bad, and so on and so forth. And we had chicken salad for dinner. On the 30th, um, there's a quote that says, I never dreamed of success, I worked for it by Estee Lauder. I am obsessed with the game The Sims Free Play. And um, I went on a Target haul, so I got the the craft stickers and then I drew that on with my white um, chalk pen um, which I was testing out out here too. Um, the chalk pen is from Michaels. I played Heyday and I woke up. And then my upcoming month is October. So guys if you like this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button over there and leave me some comments. What do you like about this setup? What don't you like about it? Um, I love sharing this with you. Do, would you like to see more pictures? Um, do you like seeing the little bits of my day? Do you think there's another way I could be effectively writing down what I'm doing during the day that is better than using these sticky notes? Um, 
What do you think I should change? Do you like the way it is? Let me know what you think in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. Um, so guys, I will see you later and have a great night. Bye.